Snow chances going up for some of you. Chief Neurologist Joe Diaz has your certified most accurate forecast. Uh, yeah, we do have some uh, drier air briefly moving into a large part of the state. Uh, snow on the increase throughout northwestern sections of New Mexico and southwestern sections of Colorado. This would be for Wednesday and then rain, wind and snow on the increase again from another system as we get into Monday of next week. So here's this low pressure system that's uh, working in from California and it will be impacting us as we get into the middle part of the week and that will produce some snow showers around uh, areas around Chama, the mountain around Chama, but heaviest throughout the mountains of southwestern Colorado, maybe even a light accumulation expected over in the Durango region, and this would be primarily on Wednesday. Now for tomorrow morning with the dry air pushing on in, we're not going to have the widespread fog like we had this morning, but uh, yeah, we'll be cold. We'll be in the 30s and 40s throughout many areas as we get to the afternoon. We'll see uh, 40s and 50s throughout the northern part of the state, some 60s and 70s to the south. A few rain showers around the Farmington area with snow throughout the higher terrain in southwestern Colorado. Notice on Wednesday that snow starts to pick up in those areas and we'll also see a few rain showers try to pull up into parts of southeastern New Mexico. Now this system quickly rolls on through as we get on into Thursday and on Thursday we're going to see uh, drier skies working in. We'll have cooler conditions working in. Uh, temperatures dropping to near normal levels here around the Albuquerque area and then stronger winds across the eastern half of the state from that uh, departing system. Now as we look at the changes over the uh, next seven days you see temperatures in the 40s and 50s throughout Cortez, Durango, on into Farmington with some rain and snow mixes across the area a little bit tomorrow, picking up with some rain and snow as we work on into Wednesday as well and a stronger system toward the beginning of next week. All right, as we look at the southwest, you see temperatures in the 60s from uh, areas from Socorro down into Deming, a few rain showers around for Wednesday before dry skies work in for a while with increasing snow showers by Monday of next week. 60s to 70 southeastern parts of New Mexico, we could get a few rain showers pulled in the area before we dry out. Windy conditions by Monday with dropping daytime highs. Overnight lows in the 30s throughout areas around Raton on into the East Mountains with a 49 for a high expected over in the Cedar Crest area will be in the 50s around Las Vegas. So above normal daytime highs there. Winds increasing for your Thursday. Less wind on Friday. Winds increasing again along with some dropping temperatures Saturday and Sunday. And then a few snow showers will try to work into the area as we get into Monday of next week. 25 to Tonight in Red River, a high of 40 degrees. We'll see uh, Santa Fe, a couple of rain showers around, and then drier with uh, another dropping temperature as we get into Monday with a few snow showers around, too. We'll continue to monitor that. And less foggy across the area in the morning, and we'll have uh, partly cloudy skies in the afternoon, a high of 54 degrees. We'll see some rain or snow mixes with the area on Wednesday, this would be uh, scattered across the area, more to the north and west. Breezy and cooler for Thursday, and notice cold mornings return, mostly cloudy skies by Sunday. And again, so those rain and snow chances, along with windy conditions by Monday of next week. So a big turnaround with drier conditions for tomorrow, Shelly.